ゼロになったっていい」What's up, guys? So we are at DNA. We look good, we feel good, so we're gonna lift good. Start off with squats first. I already did my mobility routine, so we're just gonna start warming up with just the bar. And then the great thing about being in a powerlifting gym is that this is a combo rack, so I can use this for squat and bench. We'll be here for the next two compounds. But uh, yeah, let's get started and let's start warming up. All right, so remember your rack height. Mine, I got lucky. This is actually already set to my rack height. All I had to do was just move the bar up here. Um, this area right here is for the squat. And then down here, this is for bench. I put this up here and it's easier for me to just get under here and pick up the seat. And move it out of the way. Uh, I don't know where to put it actually. This is too heavy for you guys, ask for help. Don't be a weenie. I got my squat shoes on. Um, I love using squat shoes for the lack of my ankle mobility. So these help me uh, hit my depth. And we're gonna do one set of 10. actually oh I do it up one I thought it was on eight but it was actually on seven so I'm just gonna lift it up real quick put the pin in the right one it looks a lot better the other one was a, a little bit too short there's actually no safeties on this one it's okay cuz we won't be going that heavy today so I probably won't need them but if I do need help I'll just ask for a spotter so it's no big deal okay guys so I'm actually pretty sad because um, my tripod broke on the way here, so uh, now I'm using this tripod that I found in a corner somewhere, but it's kind of broken, so it's a little sus, and I'm just hoping my camera doesn't fall. Okay, so we're gonna do this for uh, five reps. Really make sure the bar is dug in there and set. And then step back, one, two, and then adjust if you need to. Four, five. I'm gonna do this for four reps. Put my own playlist on. I made a playlist called Muscle Mommy Mondays, which I will link below. Um, and we're gonna we're gonna play that because that shit gives me hype. Hey, boy, when I saw it, I said, "Baby, you have to be for me." Pass it to me, yes, yes. And if not, I'm gonna rob it. If I see her in the street, mommy, if I see you, I'll turn you off. Roba en la 07 y viendo tendo La diablita ocupa un demonio como Kendo Un real G como Ñango No le gusta antibiótico Ok, so that's all really good My hands are slippery, so I'm gonna put some chalk on That way the plate doesn't accidentally slip Don't forget practice safe sets My music's not playing and it's pissing me off So this is 70 kg and I need to go to 82 kg. So like I said before, this doesn't have safeties. So I'm gonna ask Mark to spot me just because I just never know if I'm gonna miss groove on accident or something's just not gonna feel right. So I'm asking for help just in case for safety reasons. So Mark is here and he's gonna spot me. 
<laughs> well, I'm doing this for one set, five reps, and then after this, we'll bring it down to 70% of my um, one rep max. And then uh, we'll do that for two sets, eight reps. But uh, yeah, just for safety reasons, I have Mark, because in my head, I'm like, I don't have safeties. And it's fucking with me. So let's hit this. finished with our top set we're gonna back down to a uh, two sets eight reps at 70 percent so <laughs> felt amazing this is the first time they felt this good in a long time um so i'm very happy about that i'm gonna take off our squat shoes i'm sad because i forgot my bench shoes i use the bankus they are the best shoe i have ever used for a bench and a left so i'm gonna have to use my running shoes which don't do it as great as when it comes to like gripping the floor but oh well, we're just gonna have to make do. So like I said before, remember your rack height. For squats, I'm an eight. And then for bench, I'm actually a six. So I'm gonna put it to six. It's time for bench. Like I said before, I always warm up with a bar. I like to grab onto the bench right here just to make sure that I'm in the middle of the bench and I'm not off to the sides or anything like that. I do, I do wide grip. I used to do close grip, but wide grip just works better for me. Tuck in those shoulders. Unrack. Keep that tension. Butt down. Chest to bar. Two, three, 13, 14, 15. And I want you to feel like you're squeezing a pencil in between your shoulder blades. I'm a little shaky. I think it's because I'm tired from squat. I'm also really hungry, but it is what it is. Okay, so we're gonna do this for four, and this will determine how it will feel for my top set. All right, so we're gonna add a 1.25 because we are doing 75% of my max and we're gonna do that for one set, three reps. I'm gonna get Mark as a spotter just because my mind is just not working today because there's no safeties. That's really messing with my lift. That goes to show it's all mentality here. All right, let's do this. Let's go. Thank you. All right, moving on to our working set. We're going to do two sets of 10 repetitions. <laughs> that was tough, but a good tough. 
definitely had a really push on those last two. Okay, uh, can you just make sure I don't die? I, I struggled on the last two, so. <laughs> All right, guys, last set, best set. Good. Yeesh. I thought you did an eight. No, ten. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Oh, my hands feel like noodles. I feel like a bowl of sopa. Sopa huevona. Sopa and bona? Sopa huevona. I feel dizzy. Guys, I am sweating so much today. One, because the air here is not like on full blast, which I love. I love sweating, but I'm sweating extra because I'm drinking the Alpha Lion Burn. Oh, it's making me sweat, bro. What I need. <laughs> Mark's on a bulk right now. He's getting ready for his first bodybuilding competition. If you guys want to see his progress and like his little adventure to uh, being a bodybuilder, check out his channel. I'll, I'll link it below in case you guys want to follow and uh, get a booty gain like his. Quick tip for those of you who are beginner powerlifters, when you're training, train like if you are lifting at your comp. By that I mean train with cues. So example with bench, there are three cues. And you'll bring the bar down to your chest, but you cannot move until the judge says press. And depending on the judge depends on how long they actually make you pause it for. So once they say press, you press and you hold it up there the entire time and then once they say rack then you can put it back in the rack if you do not do that it will not count you will get red lighted so the biggest thing that i did when i first started powerlifting i would train in command with all my lifts squat bench and deadlift just a quick tip for you guys but we are off to accessories Okay, on to shoulder press. We're gonna do three sets of eight. I usually do 20s, um, but today we are gonna move up and we're gonna do 25 for eight. See how strong these little shoulders are getting. One, two, seven, eight. Oh. Oh, that feels pretty good. All right. All right, ponte las pilas, Jessica. Come on. One, two, eight. Oh, I almost choked on my saliva on that one. God damn. We're gonna rest for about 30 seconds and then move on to our last set. The goal is to start waking up at six in the morning and come to the gym earlier in the day, so like around 10 a.m. That way I can like beat traffic coming here and then beat traffic going back home because this gym is 30, 40 minutes away from my home. Um, but right now it's the only gym that I like coming to and we're gonna stick to it. Plus I'm moving closer to this area in like two months, so I'm excited. But yeah, oh shit, last it. Last it, guys. I'm talking too much. Stop distracting me. One. Two, seven, eight. Okay, so up next is RDLs. And we're gonna do these for three sets, 10 reps. I like to use uh, wrist straps. That way it lets me focus on the actual muscle group that I want to target. That way I don't have to really worry about like my grip or my forearms burning or the weight slipping off my hand. So I got them nice and sturdy locked and secured that way i can focus on the actual movement that i want to focus on so remember when you want to control the weight on the way down Three. 
Hamilton. Oh, damn. My legs are burning. Ooh. So we're gonna do a chest supported row. We are doing three sets of 12. So for this one, I'm gonna put my chest on the chair. Knee slightly bent and then, oh, that does burn. That hurts. Last accessory, hammer curls. And we are doing these for three sets, 20 reps. So I'm gonna pick 10 pounds and do that for 20. So don't judge me, okay? It's heavy for me. All right, so pick whatever weight feels good for you. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna choose 10 because I don't see any 12. It goes straight to 15 and I ain't doing 15, bro. I ain't doing it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I am so happy I stuck with 20 pounds, dude. Shit, that burned. Okay. Dude. All right, guys, I am Dunsies, but I gotta go home and feed my doggies. So I will catch you guys next time. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Okay, love you, bye.